Hey everybody, um, Dr. Brian Atkins here um, with the Atkins Academy. Um, definitely want to thank you for uh, joining us for our Facebook Live uh, Q&A session for the question of the week. We have a couple questions that we'll go over today um, and certainly um, just get your insight and get your thoughts. We have a, um, several people who have um, already answered uh, in the uh, question box and on our Instagram, our Facebook, and our Twitter pages. Um, and thank you for doing that, uh, Mary Reyna, uh, as well as several others who have um, submitted their um, their answers. We'd love to um, certainly engage even more, and so feel free to contact us. Um, you can definitely reach out to us um, in regards to learning more about our TEAS test prep uh, program, our HESI program. Uh, 301-960-4950 is, uh, is our office line. You can reach me or reach my assistants, and we'll be happy to tell you more about our T's and HESI prep course. Um, but let's take a look at I have one of our questions that we had um, here, and that is uh, our question of the week here that, that we've had previously, and that is um, that is a map has a scale of one, to, um, one inch to five miles, right? So that's a ratio. Um, of, for every one inch, that's uh, equivalent to five miles in real life. So one inch on paper means five miles in real life. And so if we have 4.5 inches um, apart, um, what we want to do is, um, what I always recommend is take a look at your answer choices, get a sense of what they're giving you as options. And so we have 11 miles and we have 22.5 miles. Well, the thing is that if we have 4.5 inches um, apart in terms of the two points on the map, even if we took that and multiply that by five, so let's say we'll go with what you know, 5 times 5 is 25, we should be a little bit less than 25 in terms of our actual answer here. 11 is way too low, so definitely 22.5 would be closer to where we should be. So 5 times 4.5 is going to be 22.5. Right? Closer to that 25, again, go with what you know. If you're taking my class before, you know what I mean by that. So again, we talk about really being in the ballpark, being, understanding where you are, and going with what you know. It's very, very important, especially when it comes to the math section. Let's take a look at another uh, question of the week here. So, um, so what is uh, 5,843 millimeters converted to centimeters? So we definitely want to um, understand the metric system and understand how the metric system works here. So let's take a look at the uh, metric system here. And so with the metric system, we have our, we have our prefixes. And so part of, part of those prefixes is tera, giga, mega, kilo, uh, deci, centi, milli, micro, nano, and also pico. Okay. And so, um, and so with that, one tera... For example, one terabyte or one teragram or one terameter or liter, for example, would be one trillion, right? So one trillion. Whereas giga is billion, right? And uh, and uh, mega is million. Whereas kilo is uh, is thousand. We also have um, we also have um, centi. Uh, we have uh, uh, we have he I should say we have heca, which is going to be a hundred. We also have deca, which is going to be ten. Those are not really listed here, but I'll just give you those. But also deci, um, which is less than a tenth of something, centi, which is a hundredth of something, right? And so we can kind of see those uh, there as well. You definitely, definitely want to know the metric system, especially um, going into the nursing profession and healthcare profession. So we'll definitely talk a lot about this and a lot about the metric system uh, during the class time. And so certainly, um, certainly, um, certainly consider uh, taking our class. I mean, these are just some of the scores that we've been able to help our clients to get. And so that's uh, uh, Miss Stevens there. She's got a 92. And that was just very recently. And so that's in uh, January. And so she's um, really killed it in all the sections as well there. You can certainly see. Uh, and so, you know, if you're looking for scores like that, we can definitely help you help you to get there. But that's not even uh, just, just, just just one of the scores. Here's another, here's another one, Danielle. Um, again, an 86.7. Pretty good score. Score. Definitely, um, we'll get into uh, uh, you know we'll, we'll be very competitive for Seminole State. So if you're looking to get into Seminole State or Sac State or San Diego State and really being competitive for the for, for a lot of these uh, schools in the in these very competitive places, you definitely want to um, want to consider our course. Um, and so here is um, here is Han. 92.7. So we can definitely help you to get that um, as well. And so just as it says, you know, why wait? Right. Um, so why wait? Schedule your T's uh, prep course online now with us. Right. And so, again, I'm Dr. Brian Atkins with the Atkins Academy. I'll leave that number up there for you. Three zero one nine six zero four nine five zero. Like I said, would love to um, would love to hear from you. Would love to help you to prepare for the T's test um, or the HESI exam. Um, so definitely give me a call. I'm happy to talk to all of my clients. Um, all of my clients have my cell phone number. They can call me or text me or email me for any questions they have throughout the entire course. That's that's a part of our program. It's a loyalty that I that I certainly um, 
provide to all of my clients. Uh, but also um, with our course, uh, you can retake classes. We certainly have that repetition component, but we also provide you with a guarantee. We want you to be at least at an 85 or better. So give me a call. Let's explain a little bit more about our course and how it all works. Um, you know, certainly I do this all the time. Every Sunday and every single Wednesday, I'm always teaching class. So feel free to reach out to me. Again, 301-960-4950. If you uh, know any of our students, um, ask them. They'll tell you. It's a very intense, very in-depth course, but I swear you will definitely, definitely know the material, and you will understand, again, how life works and how to really do well in the TEAS test. All right, we'll see you um, next time when we do um, our next uh, live uh, um, post, okay? And so definitely join us on Mondays at 7 p.m. for our live Q&A sessions. All right. Thanks to everyone for joining in and, uh, and um, liking us our page. Definitely check out some of our um, some of our segments of our of our classes on YouTube as well. So the Atkins Academy YouTube channel. Certainly subscribe and like our like our page on the YouTube channel. You actually see real live explanations that I've done during the class time um, as well. So um, until next time, we'll see you next time. All right. Thanks.